Hello everyone, my name is Azad Martin. I am the founder and creator of Node University, the ultimate resource on JavaScript and Node.js. And I'm also the author of this brand new book, React Quickly. We've published it in the second half of 2017. So depending on when you're watching this video, it could be the most up-to-date book on React or at least somewhere in that range. As I've mentioned in the book itself, each chapter comes with the video. So you have the QR code in the beginning of each chapter. You can use any of the application from your smartphone to scan that QR code. So you just scan this QR code and in a very short video clip in three to five minutes of your time. I know your time is the most valuable resource. A lot of people are busy right now, super busy. So I'm not going to waste a lot of your time. I will explain what that particular chapter has. And then you can decide whether you want to read it or you can skip it and move to the next chapter, watch the video again and then decide again. Maybe you already know some of those concepts, so let's not waste too much of your time, let's not waste any of your time, and just get to the most necessary for things for you. So let's dive right into the first chapter and see what it has. What is React? Let's give a definition of React.js. React.js is just a UI library, user interface, nothing more, nothing less. But it does its work really, really well. That's why a lot of people, a lot of developers, including me, we are super, super excited about React. Then to continue with this theme, with the theme of meeting React and introducing you to React, I will explain you what problem React solves. I'll give you some historical context in which React was born and what problem React solves the best. Then I will explain you how React will fit into your particular web application. What are some rendering targets? What are some other React related libraries such as React Router, Redux, and other other libraries which you might want to use and which we will cover in the part two of this book. Single page application, SPA. I will explain how React fits into that architecture and also explain you about the best, the most recommended, the most popular React stack. Then at the end of this first chapter, you would build your first React application. It would be purely JavaScript implementation. Of course, it's going to be an easy one. It's going to be a Hello World application. In the end of this chapter, as in all other chapters except the project chapters, you will have a quiz, a summary, and also the quiz answers to test how well you did on the quiz. So that's it for the first chapter. Thank you for watching. If you like this format of short introduction videos for each chapter, then go ahead and continue. If video is not, a, is not your format, don't worry. Everything and much, much, much more, it's in the book. You can just read the book. You don't have to watch videos. You're not going to miss anything on the videos. Videos are just supplemental. They're just to make it a little bit easier for those of you who prefer the video format, for those of you who already know some parts of React. They will. It, it's like a shortcut. The videos are shortcut. Uh, they're definitely not required, they're not necessary. If you like to focus just on text, go ahead and just read the book. If you want to save a little bit of time to get a preview of each chapter, watch a video, watch a short five-minute clip, scan the QR code on your smartphone and be done with it. And leave the comments if you're watching it on YouTube on some other platform, leave your comments, tell me how you like this format, and maybe in my future books I will do more and more of these type of introductions. I'll see you in the next video, have a great reading and great rest of your day.